This is my second year at Aquition as a jury member. It's been a wonderful, wonderful experience because I'm one of the non-architect members of the group. Uh, last year we were like a thick divide. Uh, the professional architect on one side, the non-architects on the other side. We kind of ganged up together and uh, we know that uh, the architects mo know more than us uh, when it comes to the structure of the building, the plan and how it's executed. But we work on instinct, so we kind of wanted to learn a lot from them and also protest if uh, the architects went too technical because building is not about technique and technology, it's about how you feel when you enter a building or see the building. But this year it's been completely different, we're all one. Uh, there is no difference between an architect and a non-architect and it's so easy for us to learn a lot of things from the architects also. When they say no, this is not good architecturally, so we ask them why? Why do you say this is not good enough to be uh, from an architect's point of view? So this uh, whole judging has been a great learning experience for me. What I'm looking forward to in judging is uh, to, uh, last year we were like non-architect um, members but this year we are professional jury members so we want to go one step ahead and learn about how a building is conceived and what are the kind of uh, qualities that an architect or uh, principles that an architect has already decided about the eco-friendliness, about uh, um, sustainability and about innovation and things like that. So it's, it's like being an undergrad to doing a post-graduation now. That's how it is for me, uh, being a jury of Acquisition Prize. I've come from the film industry. Um, we create life in front of camera. It might be only two hours, but we create life. We make it as authentic as possible. The first thing that we create is when we write a story and we create characters, we, we create a location for them where do they uh, actually perform from. So the ambience, the building is very, very important. From an actor's and a writer and a film person's uh, point of view, when I see a building, I want to know how closer I feel to the building you know, how it touches me most. Emotionally, I should have a connect. That is what I'm looking at when I'm seeing uh, uh, the building, the best building built by an architect. We're also not looking at just the one building that she's building, but the several buildings, and then see whether it's just about architecture, it's just about her technique, it's just about her talent, or is it just about being successful, the grandeur, the perfection, or it, does it go beyond uh, uh, herself, and the work that she is involved in and to the society and from society even move on to the global you know not just society is just about people but if you go beyond people and look at nature the ecological balance and things like that that's what i think as a film person that's what i'm looking at emotional touch this is going to be a very very inspiring uh, award for any person and more so for a woman because uh, Woman is always looked at as somebody who nourishes a home. She never has a say in making a home. She makes it beautiful, but she doesn't really create it. It's the man's money or the family money that creates it. It's never the woman, but the woman is the one who embellishes it. But with this award, I think a woman feels completely, she's just not embellishing it, making it beautiful. She's the one who's creating it from ground zero. You know, that's, that's what it means. Uh, this prize is a complete creation as far as a successful today modern woman is concerned.